Welcome. Today we will be ripping off this great video from Corridor Digital, which uses an AI program to transform digital characters into real people by taking features of real humans from a big picture bank and then compiling them. Go check it out. I'm shamelessly stealing it. Anyway, ground rules for Dota characters. First, the AI looks for human features. Not a lot of humans in Dota, surprisingly, so we used alternate cosmetics, fan art, hell on some heroes we just drew in pupils and shit to make it work. Also, angle is key here. Check out this close-up Enchantress. And now the slightly zoomed out Enchantress. Oh! Did you guys know the ghost of Ben Franklin lives in Dazzle's eyeballs? We did every single hero until we were satisfied with these wildly varying results. So if you think you can do better, the link to the program is in the description. Have at it, sports fan. Who are we? Tsunami, who I pitched this idea to in the first place, and he made it a reality. MVP for him. Tanker Smash on Twitter, who watched me do this on stream, saw me struggling, and made a Dota-specific program. What a god. And Mr. V, who sent me countless horrible attempts at heroes. Okay, with all that out of the way, let's get started. Abaddon. This guy looks like the basis of my chemical romance. He probably cries, and he lets people know about it. 9 out of 10. The tiny little alchemist. Well, he does look like a tiny little alchemist. I'd keep him in the tiny little jar and have him make poop in the gold. 9 out of 10. Alchemist is ogre. Looks dumb, strong, could probably help you move. Would be dumb enough to help you move. 9 out of 10 again. Ancient apparition. He's supposed to be the heat death of the universe personified. He looks like a guy who's too nervous to ask to join the anime club in high school. Uh, this is a 0 out of 10. Uh, shameful. Anti-Mage. This looks like the kid in middle school that used to give me swirlies in the man's bathroom. Absolutely terrifying. I hate it, and it brings back painful memories. 9 out of 10. Female Anti-Mage. If you're gonna do what I think you're gonna do when you see this image, I really hope you accidentally hit the play button and you have to hear my voice while you're doing it. 11 out of 10. Arc Warden. Okay, that's literally Elon Musk. I'm not sure how that happened, but there you go. Spaceman is Spaceman. 9 out of 10. Axe with pupils. This looks like a guy that ate someone's face in Florida after too many bath salts. Uh, that is a 2 out of 10. Axe without pupils. This looks like the guy who sold on the bath salts at the grocery store. An innocent man. 1 out of 10. Bane. I thought he was supposed to be the personification of nightmares, not a, a dream boat. <laughs> 1 out of 10. Okay, it's the one y'all been simping over for years now. Let's see who you have devoted your lives to, my friends. <laughs> you get what you deserve. 10 out of 10. Blonde Dark Willow. Oh shit, she got the mumps. Stay away from her. Shit's contagious. 9 out of 10. Bat Rider. Pretty handsome. Kind of looks like Lil a little bit. That's a 9 out of 10. Beastmaster. This guy doesn't look like he masters beasts. It looks like he killed small animals when he was a child. Then he had sex with them. That's an 8 out of 10. Bloodseeker. This guy looks like he's seeking my car insurance after accidentally rear-ending his Subaru legacy. Vice it to say, 3 out of 10. Bounty Hunter. The only thing this guy's hunting is crystal meth. 7 out of 10. Brewmaster. Jesus Christ! The ravages of alcoholism. 9 out of 10. Alternate Brewmaster. Is that a Discord mod? 10 out of 10. Ah, Bristleback, the quintessential online bully. What do online bullies look like in real life? Yeah, that checks out. 10 out of 10. Broodmother actually looks like a sweet older mother. I would want you to be my mommy. Can you make me some cookies, please? 6 out of 10. Centaur War Runner looks less like the champion of the arena, more like a dad who just walked into his kid watching hentai. Uh, that's going to be a 3 out of 10. Chaos Knight. Well, that's not what I expected, but isn't that chaos in itself? Not really. 1 out of 10. Jen. It, is that Charles Barkley? What's he doing here? 9 out of 10. Magical Chen. Kind of looks like he's wearing an earring. That's it. I just like that. Chen should have earring cosmetics. Cosmetic makers, where are you at? Still 9 out of 10. Plinks. Is that what he looked like before he got set on fire? He does kind of look like an Olympic archer, which is not a compliment. I don't know why those guys look like such nerds. Isn't archery supposed to be cool? Well, this is not cool. 3 out of 10. Cool clinks. All right, I'm feeling it. Looks like he's currently being set on fire by that demon. You know what, clinks? 4 out of 10. Good job, buddy. Clockwork. Yep, this looks like everybody that tries to get you to watch the show BattleBots. This one checks out. 
9 out of 10. Alternate clockwork. If you spent less time listening to Skrillex, maybe we wouldn't have gotten a D on our group project, asshole. 2 out of 10. Crystal Maiden. Looks cold, extremely depressed, and with a hint of slightly psychotic. Sums up every Crystal Maiden player I've ever met. Uh, 11 out of 10. Bald Crystal Maiden. Horrifically accurate. Zero out of a million. Darkseer. Actually looks like an alternate dimension Doctor Who. A dimension jumping time traveler. I, I'm into it. Surprisingly, I, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Dawnbreaker. Looks like a, a discount pop star hanging around a Starbucks trying to get people to listen to her uh, album. A little less on the makeup, miss. 7 out of 10. Alternate Dawnbreaker. Looks like my court-appointed lawyer that was supposed to get me out of juvie. Well, she didn't. Thanks for nothing. 2 out of 10. Dawnbreaker with pupils. Looks like a uh, Nyx assassin was in the game and she just casted her ult. Sorry about that. 9 out of 10. Dazzle. Not much to comment here. Guy looks like Dazzle. Looks pretty happy. Good for him. I've never been that happy in my life. 8 out of 10. Death Prophet. Less uh, predicting death, more predicting when you're not going to be in your trailer so she can try to rob it. Uh, not a fan. 4 out of 10. Death Prophet Front View. Is that Lady Gaga? Why is she trying to break into my trailer? Still 4 out of 10. Disruptor. Well, that definitely looks like somebody that thinks they can control the weather. This is the kind of guy that walks around the desert with a stick and two prongs in it, promising that he'll lead you to water. Well, he won't. 6 out of 10. Classic Dragon Knight model. Okay, that actually looks like a Dragon Knight. That is sick. A million out of 10. Let's go. It's perfect. Anime Dragon Knight. It is the opposite of perfect. Get it off of the screen. I hate it. Burn the monitor. Zero out of a million. In-game anime Dragon Knight. Okay, you know, a, a good mix of the two. Let's bring it back to the out of tens. Uh, 10 out of 10. Doom. Looks like my carry when he's been Doom. Uh, that's a uh, 7 out of 10. Io teaches diversity training at the community college and never lets anyone raise their hand. Uh, depressing. 10 out of 10. Drow Ranger. Rihanna's long lost sister who lives in the Appalachian Mountains. That's a uh, blue out of 10. Karen Drow Ranger. You can see my manager. 9 out of 10. Too heavy on the eyebrow makeup, Drow Ranger. Too heavy on the eyebrow makeup. Out of 10. Earthshaker. That looks like a pedophile. 3 out of 10. Alternate Earthshaker. Okay, that looks like a guy you'd find in a cave uh, eating a bunch of magic mushrooms and he would offer to share them. I like this guy. 7 out of 10. Elder Titan. He broke the world and she broke her custody agreement. It's a 3 out of 10. Ooh, face Elder Titan. He broke the world and he'll break your face. 8 out of 10. Ember Spirit looking right. Okay, this guy actually looks like a martial arts instructor. Maybe at a, you know, a mall or something. That's a 5 out of 10. Ember Spirit looking left. This guy banned you from a Discord channel because you were talking to a girl that he is interested in. That's a, still a 5 out of 10. Enchantress. Got invited to a party and won't stop asking everybody what their astrology sign is. Also keeps trying to sell everyone at the party crystals. 9 out of 10. Side view Enchantress. Just is legitimately Enchantress. Perfect out of 10. Perfect. Enigma. Well... That's it. Incredibly disappointing out of 10. Earth Spirit. I don't know why, but this picture really pisses me off. I, I, can't, I can't put my finger on it, but that guy really, I hate his face and I hate Earth Spirit and I hate you. One out of 10, one out of a million. Hate it. Faceless Void. Okay, that actually looks like a Cthulian-like space nightmare. Uh, something that we should have never seen. Incredibly lore accurate, 10 out of 10. Grimstroke without the mask does look like a pained artist. I'll take it. 8 out of 10. Grimstroke with the mask. This looks like a rich artist that draws that modern art crap. He drew like 50 paintings of a soup can and he's a billionaire. I hate him. Uh, 9 out of 10 still though. Gyro without cosmetics. I think I bought a hot dog off this guy. That's a 10 out of 10. Gyro with cosmetics. That looks like somebody's dad. If that's your dad, uh, say that's my dad in the comments. It's a dad out of 10. Hoodwinked without the hood. 
somehow looks like Little John from Robin Hood, which makes sense because she's in the forest and, you know, stealing money and stuff. You know, I, I don't know how this happened, but uh, I'll take it. That's a, uh, still like a 4 out of 10. Though. Hoodwinked with a hood. Cashier at Hot Topic who's having some trouble opening the register because the chain connected to their wallet keeps falling down. 10 out of 10. Oscar! It's the best we could do. I'm sorry, everyone, but that is what he looks like, and you're just gonna have to deal with it. It's, uh, 1 out of 10. Alternate Huskar. Looks like a, a replacement in a martial arts movie. You know, like the stand-in, the body double guy. Doesn't actually have any skills, but just gets kicked in the head really hard. 2 out of 10, I guess. Chad Invoker. This is the kind of kid in high school that only the coolest nerds get picked on. Please pick on me, Chad Invoker, please. 10 out of 10. Invoker on the enemy team. Smart, rushes Midas and gets it by five minutes, knows every single spell by heart. Also 10 out of 10. Invoker on your team. That's exactly what he looks like. Also 10 out of 10. Fair representation. Firehead Jakiro. Looks like he's having a great time. Good for him. 9 out of 10. Icehead Jakiro. Looks exactly like what I think he'd look like. Having an okay time. 9 out of 10. Ice and Firehead meshed into one human. Absolutely horrific. I love it. 10 out of 10. Juggernaut. Looks like Brianna Tarth got into a, a hydraulic press machine. Uh, that's a 1 out of 10. Alternate Juggernaut. Looks a little less like the last samurai, more like the uh, last guy to get off the bus. Uh, that's also a 1 out of 10. Keeper of the Light. Old man who refuses to acknowledge that he's going bald, so he buys a very bad hairpiece. That is a very, very sad 2 out of 10. Kanka legitimately looks like a sea captain. Impressive stuff, 9 out of 10. HD Kunkka looks like a side character that died on an episode of Game of Thrones that everybody forgot about. Uh, that's a 7 out of 10. Legion Commander without any hat. Uh, looks like a runway model. Very fancy and elegant. Uh, 6 out of 10. Fur Coat Legion Commander. This lady goes to the fanciest restaurant in town and leaves a 5% tip. Uh, that is a 5% out of 10. Legion Commander with Marana's hair. I'm just gonna leave this one as it is with a 10 out of 10 and no further explanation. Lashrak looks like a guy who wants to die. That checks out. I love it. 10 out of 10. Lich. This guy looks like he's frozen on Mount Everest and people use him as a waypoint on their way up to the summit. Uh, that's a very useful 7 out of 10. Alternate Lich. Looks a little bit more like an evil wizard. Not evil enough, though. 2 out of 10. Lifestealer. The final boss of the Karens. Uh, last to see the manager in an extremely angry manner. Already has the Yelp open to leave the bad review. 1 out of 5 stars. Ultimate Karen when she finds out that you are, in fact, the manager. 5 out of 5 stars. Lena's nose. Enjoy sleeping tonight. Uh, zero out of zero. Front facing Lena. Actually smoking hot. Uh, yeah, uh, I, uh, uh, sorry. Yes. Yes! Out of ten. Upward facing Lena. Strong jawline, a good warrior, lore accurate. Lena is a, a warrior sorceress, so uh, that's a lore accurate out of ten right there. Love it. Lion. <laughs> yeah, that's Lion. That's a demon witch right there. Uh huh. That's. Uh, Perfect. perfect. A perfect out of 10. Lone Druid. Garbage. Sorry, everyone. Looks like the mom of the kid that fell into the bear pit. Uh, it's the best we could do. 1 out of 10. Luna. Holy moly. The, the scourge of the plains. The scourge of t Tinder. Ah, oh, she would accept you, swipe right, and steal all of your money, and you'd be thankful for it. Uh, that, that, whew. Swipe right out of 10. Lycan. Actually looks like a werewolf. That is a 10 out of 10 for sure. Like in front facing view. Looks like he's trying to onboard you into a multi level marketing scheme. Still scary. 10 out of 10, still. Magnus. Looks like the secret of his horn is alcoholism. 7 out of 10. Mars. Looks like Hades from the Disney Hercules movie. Except, uh, horrific. 3 out of 10. Medusa. This guy got arrested trying to sneak into the girls' locker room. Uh, 1 out of 10. Meepo. This is how the Smurf looks on his 50th consecutive Meepo victory in Herald 2 before he sells the account. Big smile. 10 out of 10. This is the 13-year-old kid that buys the Smurf account the last Meepo guy got all the way up to Immortal. I hate you. 0 out of 10. Painted Marana. 
the same explosion that took her eyebrows took 70% of her skull. 70% out of 10. In-game Murata actually, actually looks perfect. Looks like uh, if they gender swapped the live action Beauty and the Beast and uh, that that's the beast right there. That is exactly perfect, perfect out of 10 again. Monkey King. That is Monkey King. I, I don't want to play this game anymore. Shut off. No, 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 nope out of 10. Morphly. What it looks like when you pause in your favorite anime in an action scene. Uh, zero out of 10. Alternate Morphling, okay, actually looks like a marine biologist, you know? Hey, one out of 10. Naga Siren, wah wah wee wah. This is what Slark sees when he sees Naga. This is what Slardar sees. Holy, she looks like Charlize Theron. Oh, let me be one of the Theron guards. My goodness gracious, sing me to sleep, Naga. Uh, beautiful, 10 out of 10. Oh, my goodness gracious, nature's prophet, neckbeard perfection. Oh, let me into that beard. Oh, it's beautiful, it's gorgeous. It's zero out of 10. Next assassin, not what I expected, but would make an excellent assassin. Never see that coming. 10 out of 10. Ogre magic head. Actually looks like a kid who LARPs and yells fireball for eight hours straight in the park. That's a nine out of 10. Ogre brute head. Perfect, absolutely perfect. Frame it, put it on my desk. I want to look at it every day. Perfect out of 10. Perfect. Omni Knight. This is how Omni Knight would look in real life when he found out there was a patch and he starts scrolling down looking for his name. And this is him after he finds the nerfs. Rest in peace, Omni Knight, eight out of 10. Oracle. This guy looks less like an Oracle, more like a guy who would uh, link a Wikipedia article to try to win a internet argument. Uh, that's a two out of 10. Alternate Oracle. Kind of looks like Pimp Uncle in 20 years. 10 out of 10. Outworld Devourer. What can I say? This guy looks like the star of a, of a, of a movie. I literally have nothing else to say. Sorry, he looks great. 9 out of 10. Pangolier. What Perfect. the f did you expect, huh? What did you expect? A palaquin turning into a human? You think that's gonna look good? You think that's gonna look sexy? That's what it looks like, all right? Deal with it. Deal with it. 10 out of 10. Phantom Lancer actually looks like a pissed off fisherman. Probably owns a cat. That's a cat owner's face. That's a nine out of 10. Phantom Assassin. You know, they did a remodel. Our Dota 2 said her eyes were too big. At the time, I disagreed. Uh, wrong. Looks beautiful. Two out of 10. Phoenix. Pog Champ. One out of 10. We tried to get a lot of different pictures of Puck. Nothing worked. This, this person just kept coming up. Zero out of 10. Pudge. <laughs> Perfect, what can I say? Absolutely, it's great. 10 out of 10. Alternate punch. Looks exactly like the German treasurer. I'm just kidding. I don't think Germany has a treasurer, but you believed it, didn't you? You see? Uh, one out of 10. Pogna, this is the best we could do. Pogna, two out of 10. Arcana Queen of Pain. Looks like an actual person that would inflict pain on the hearts of men. 10 out of 10. Love it. Art Queen of Pain. Act, it looks even better somehow. 11 out of 10. Literal succubus. Comic Book Queen of Pain. The FBI is already on their way. You're going to jail out of 100. Classic Queen of Pain. What did you think a demon woman would look like? 10 out of 10. Okay, classic art of Queen of Pain. Yeah, 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 that looks about right. 4.8 out of 10. Razor, what do you want from me? How is anything gonna fit in that helmet? What, am I gonna disappoint the three Razor players out there? Sorry, guys. Zero out of 10. Ricky, okay. This looks like someone that would stab you in the back for literally no reason. Yes, yes, 10 out of 10, good. Sand King, he looks happy, you know? He's, he's sentient sand, it's a man made out of sand. He looks happy about it. I give him a happy face out of 10. He looking good. Shadow Fiend. Looks like some kind of salesman, maybe trying to get you in the cryptocurrency or something. You would definitely sell your soul to this guy. Yeah, 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 I'm feeling it, seven out of 10. Shadow Demon does appear to be someone that would be in a cult or start a cult or lead a cult. Uh, drink the Kool-Aid out of 10. Shadow Shaman. Would this person turn you into a chicken? Probably not. Would she own a chicken? Maybe. Maybe that's what she's so excited about. Four out of 10. Silencer. 
That's it. As boring as the hero. Three out of ten. Slardar, looking, uh, looking, looking hideous. About right. Five out of ten. Skywrath Mage, disturbingly accurate. I did not think he would be that hideous, but that is what he looks like, and I hate it. Nine out of ten. Slark, okay. Now we know why he went to jail. You know what that guy did, for sure. Ten years without parole out of ten. Spirit Breaker. This is the guy that everybody in the gang leaves behind when the cops come because he's too fat and slow, but he's the muscle, you know? Nobody is gonna miss him. That's a two out of ten. Sniper. That kid in the theater class that always wears scarves. Even if it's hot outside, they just think scarves make him look good. It does not. Two out of ten. Alternate Sniper. A balding person wearing a scarf on the beach. Now that is acceptable. We will take that. Seven out of ten. Spectre. Doesn't seem to be doing bad at all. I, I thought she'd be pretty sad, but she looks like she's having a great time. Good for her. 10 out of 10. Storm Spirit. Those who laugh are frowning the most on the inside. Not really, though. That's a 0 out of 10. Looks off. Sven. This guy's supposed to be half a mermaid. Dude looks like half a marshmallow. Not into it. 8 out of 10. Sagan. Marana's mouth. Yep. That's 10 out of 10. Techie's time. Spleen. Looks like a goddamn Chad. Let's go. 10 out of 10. Squee! Looks like somebody that would follow a Chad in a uh, suicidal explosion. Yeah, I believe it. Another 10 out of 10. Spoon. <sighs> nah, this is what he looks like. I'll take a uh, number six out of 10. Templar Assassin. Mask should not have come off. Two out of 10. Terror Blade. I'm terrified of disappointing him. Looks like a sweet man. Looks not like, however, the demon of demons. That's a one out of 10. Tidehunter. I don't know what happened here. If the last one was a one out of 10, this one is a negative 100 out of 10. Sorry, everyone. That's Tidehunter. Tippersaw. Okay, I thought it'd look like Casey. Does not look like Casey. That kind of looks like Casey. Okay, uh, eight out of 10. Tinker, fancy looking dude. Looks like a scientist. I love it. Six out of ten. Tinker without glasses. This is who should have been in the Hobbit movie. He looks so, so happy. I can't, ten out of ten. I can't break his little heart. Tiny. Burn it. Can rocks burn? Try. Burn it. Three out of ten. Tree protector. I do recycle. Thank you. You don't have to keep asking me every time I throw my trash away. It is separated. I recycle. 2 out of 10. Troll Warlord, the spitting image of the man that towed my car, looks extremely satisfied with himself. That is a 10 out of 10. Love it. Tusk! What the f*** is that? 1 out of 10. Underlord really has that Uber driver feel. I'm gonna give this one a 6 out of 10. Undyed. I, well, how is it gonna fit into that helmet? You think it'd look like something else? How, how else are you gonna fit into that helmet? That's the shape of the head you need. That's a 9 out of 10. Weekend Undying. Now that's cool. That's 10 out of 10. Ursa, happier than I thought. Would probably still maul you if found in the forest. Uh, I, sure, four out of 10. Ursa with pupils, one of the most unsettling faces I've ever seen. Do not like out of 10. Vengeful spirit, okay, the head shape ain't right, but the scowl, the scowl is there. That is a six out of 10. Short haired venge, that is also a good scowl. That's a 9 out of 10. Short hair Venge from the top. Daughter of Elvira. The rebellious Venge that isn't very vengeful. That's a 2 out of 10. Venomancer. 2K behavior score in Dota. Very toxic. 10 out of 10. Viper. Looks like he's toxic. Actually seems like he has a hint of sweetness. I'm gonna give that one a 5 out of 10. Visage. I don't have a joke here. It actually looks great. Uh, this is what I would imagine Visage to look like. I, I'm just gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Moving on. Void Spirit. Not not so much. Not so much what I... No? I mean, I guess technically he does have a neck beard. So yes, this is very accurate. 8 out of 10, but I am incredibly disappointed. Warlock. Looks like a disgusting little warlock from a movie with puppets from Jim Henson in the 1980s. Uh, that is a uh, 8 out of 10. Weaver. Why, is, why does it look so good? Why does it look so real? Why does this work so much? I'm disturbed by it. Can bugs be people? Are most people actually bugs? Yeah, I am very afraid. Uh, three out of 10. Wind Ranger. What do you want me to say? Looks exactly like Wind Ranger. I absolutely hate it. It's a 10 out of 10 and I hate it. Witch Doctor kinda looks like the TF2 medic. That tracks, that checks out. 10 out of 10. Wraith King pre-transformation. 
interesting, looks dark, looks sad, slightly afraid of death. That's uh, four out of five. Oh, now this is good. Wraith King with correct facial proportions. Absolutely what I would expect him to look like. That is a nine out of 10. Bald Wraith King. Zero. Winter Wyvern. Now I know you're thinking this doesn't look right, but Winter Wyvern is a poet author who sits in alone reading their own poetry. You can't tell me that doesn't look like that. Okay, you can't tell me. Two out of ten. Zeus, less blowing up the world with lightning, more blowing his hand off uh, with some illegal firecrackers because he was high on crystal meth. Uh, that is a nine out of ten for sure. Save some for last. Night Stalker, not because it's good, but because I forgot about Night Stalker. It's not good. In fact, it's below average. That's a four out of 10. And finally, my favorite of all, the one hero I skipped over. Were you paying attention, everyone? It is the greatest of them all. Ladies and gentlemen, Bald Snapfire. Absolutely perfect. And there you have it. That's all of them. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Long video, I know. So I'll keep it short. Had a lot of fun. If you have your own pictures, feel free to upload them and uh, link them in the description. I'd love to see your take using the free program. Don't forget it's in the description. Thanks again to the people who helped me out. And thank you to Curtis, a new $10 patron. Curtis, I haven't made a video in like six months, and you just rolled up six days ago and gave me $10. God bless God bless you. God bless all my other uh, beautiful patrons out there on Patreon. I'm probably going to make about 50 cents on this from YouTube. So you guys are really keeping me alive, feeding that baby. You guys have a great one. I'll see you at TI10. Now I've dated the video. Now it has a date. Uh, not supposed to do that. Anyway, have a good one. Bye.